Welcome to the testing world. In this session, we are going to discuss what is test case. So, a very basic definition of the test case is different conditions which we are going to test on an application specified in a formatted way that is called test case. I'm going to give you a practical example. So I'm moving to my application. URL of the application is shop.thetestingworld.com. It's an e-commerce site where user can search item. After searching, it can add to the cart and can go for the payment. So I want to test this search functionality. So before testing any functionality, we have to write test cases. So for this search functionality, we can have multiple test cases. As of now, I'm not writing these test cases in a formatted way. I'm just going to tell you how we can write unformatted test case. So first test case could be search with valid item name. My first test case would be I'm searching an item which exists in my system. So like I'm searching for iPhone, so I'm searching with the valid data. This iPhone results I'm going to get. So here we can see we are getting iPhone result. So that is the first test case that I have designed that I want to test search functionality with the valid item name. As of now, we are not writing in a formatted way. In the next session, we will understand what is the format. As of now, I'm just telling how we can you know think about the test cases what all the test cases could be and we already seen like test cases means different conditions which we are going to test on the application so if one condition was we are testing with the valid name valid item name and second condition could be or second test case could be test search with invalid item name so in that case we should not get any result i'm testing the search functionality with the second test case it is like a b c d i don't have that kind of item in my system so it should not return anything in the result so here we can see we are not getting any result as of now i'm running this test case in front of you but in real practice we are designing the test case first and then when we are getting built from the development team then we are running these test cases so i have two test cases as of now i'll say two conditions i have written formatted test case we will see in the next session so next it could be search with blank data so that's my third test case i'm writing i want to search the functionality with the blank data and again my expected would be it should not return any result fourth could be search with special characters so I'm using special characters like I phone star it depends what kind of application you are developing what kind of functionality is having and here it is not returning any results so expected result completely depend on the client requirement or fourth test case that we have written is for a special character fifth could be rather than searching the complete iPhone I'm searching just IPH so here in that case we will see what will be the result in that case because as of now i'm not giving the complete name so expected result is completely depend on the client requirement but my next test case is i'm searching with part of item name so we are not giving exact name of the item we are giving the part of the name so these are five test cases, five conditions which I have written. It could be many more conditions. Test case means different conditions which we are going to test on the application. We are not testing as of now. As of now, we are just developing the test case. So process will be we are getting a requirement from the client side. On the behalf of the requirements, we are designing these test conditions or we can call it test case. And once the test case are developed, we are getting application or we can say build for the testing. And on the build, we are running all these test cases. So if we talk about the process, 
first of all we are going to get requirements on the behalf of the requirements we will design test cases and once we are getting build with functionality that need to be tested we are running our test cases and marking it pass or fail so we are running test cases and if we are getting a result which is expected as per the client requirement we are going to make it pass else fail so different conditions like condition one was testing with correct search item second condition was incorrect search item third condition was with the special character so any number of conditions it could be so these all conditions will be written in a specified format which we are going to do in the next session this is called test case I'm going to tell you one more example of the test case I'm on the Facebook page here I'm, I want to test this login functionality now for the login functionality we could have number of test cases so I'm going to write my first test case would be first condition would be test login with correct username and password so it's my first condition or I can call it first test case second test case could be test login with correct username but incorrect password so both the test case would have different expected results first we need to test with the correct username password and uh, second correct username incorrect password my third condition could be test login with incorrect username and correct password so that's my next test case fourth condition could be test login with username in caps means cap capital letter and password is correct whatever the password is there fifth could be test login with username and password but this time password in the caps so this is my next condition again what would be the expected of all these test cases that we need to pick from client requirements we are going to write in in our test cases but as of now I have given the conditions these five conditions I want to test for the login functionality as of now I have written only five conditions but it could be many more conditions but as of now we have covered only five conditions so here in the session we have seen what is test case that's all we have for this session thanks for watching this video